Hello and welcome to a new tutorial video. This edition demonstrates methods for processing photos in batches. When photos are shot under similar lighting conditions, the same edits can be applied to all of them in a single step. Exposure is used for the demo in this video. If you don't own Exposure, download the free trial from our website. Editing adjustments are applied to all of the photos selected. Photo selection operations in Exposure work the same way as in the operating system. Command or Control A selects all of the images displayed in the grid. Command or Control Click selects or deselects one image at a time. And Shift Click selects a consecutive group of images. For more control, image metadata can be used to create and modify selections. Invert the current selection of photos with Command U. You can apply these same selection commands to entire groups of images by clicking, shift clicking, or command clicking on the group headers. There are a few different techniques for editing multiple images at the same time. One way to apply edits to several photos is with the previous button. Simply edit an image by applying a preset or by making adjustments using the editing panels. Next, select one or more of the images to apply the same look to. Simply press the Previous button to propagate the same edits to all of the photos. Brushed on effects or bokeh focus regions may need to be adjusted manually to fit with the other images in the batch. Another way to apply edits to multiple images is by copying edits to the clipboard and then pasting to a group of images. Editing adjustments can be copied using the Edit menu. Copy and paste are especially helpful when using Exposure as a standalone. You can seamlessly revisit past shoots. Copy eye-catching finished looks. And paste the same effects to images from a new shoot. Batches of photos can be edited directly by selecting multiple images. Any editing adjustments made will be applied to all selected photos. This is especially beneficial when working with images captured in varying lighting conditions. A large group of images can be selected and adjusted. Then, smaller batches of similar photos can be selected for detailed corrections. These batch editing techniques make it easy to process large photo shoots quickly. And that completes this lesson in batch editing photos. Thanks for watching. Check out exposure.software for more information about exposure and more videos.